y'all. Granny is finally on here. This is Granny's Kitchen. Thanks for tuning in. Today we're making a blueberry crunch and we're going to just go ahead and get started tonight. But first, Granny is going to tell you where she got her, her recipe. I got my recipe from my late sister, Geraldine Carl Allen, um, back probably 10 or 15 years ago. But it's real good and I think you'll enjoy it. And I'm going to make it tonight for you and... Uh, if you need the recipe, we can come up with that too. Yes, we'll so. give you the full recipe. So let's get started tonight. All right, so go ahead. Okay, first of all, uh, it's a large crushed pineapple. And you pour it in your pan. How big is your pan? It's what a size? nine by 13. Okay. And you, you're you gonna save your juice. Put your juice yeah, in you all pour it all in there. In there. And, uh, just sort of take a spoon and, and just smooth it out like, you know. Okay. Then you take your blueberries. How many blueberries? You can use two cups. It said it calls for two cups or three cups. Now, I use three because we like the blueberries. Okay. You, you can put that off. Okay. And where did you get the blueberries from? From Mr. Bunch. It's my uh, granddaughter's <laughs> in law, I guess you'd call her. Corbin's um, her, wife. Her dad. Corbin's owns wife, Kate. Blueberry uh, orchard. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Pineapple in there and the blueberries and on top of the blueberries sometimes they're not real sweet So you just sprinkle a Three-fourths cup of sugar on top of your blueberries okay. or however much if you like it real real sweet You can add a little bit more And you can okay. use any kind of fruit with this you can do peaches um, you can do without the pineapple though. That'd be that'd be weird. But and then you can do cherries, and you can also do pie filling. If you don't have fresh blueberries, you can do um, a blueberry pie filling. It makes it good too. All right. Okay, and and after you get the sugar on, you can. Uh, <coughs> you, it takes a box of yellow cake mix. And you put that all of it on there. Just pour the whole cake mix. The whole the cake mix on it. <laughs> and how much butter do you use too? If you get all the the um, cake mix on here, you sort of spread it out, and you put. Uh, you melt two sticks of butter and dribble it over the top of this and use all your butter now because it, it'll make it sort of not being so dry. And crunchy. The first time I made this, I mixed up the cake mix and then poured it. Oh, well. Yeah, it was awful. It didn't taste good at all. That looks like a white cake mix. Yeah, I guess. And the butter cake mix is good too. Mm -hmm. Well, that's usually what I use. That is butter, ain't it? Mm -mm, it's just yellow. Okay. Wait, let her spread it out first, buddy. You just take something and spread the top out where it won't be higher in spots. And... <coughs> okay, and you take two, your two sticks of butter Drizzle it all over. Yeah, just go all over. Pecans. Yes, and yeah. we're going to take our pecans. And I'll, I'll do those. And we're I'm right here, over here, and I've got a chopper, and I'm just going to give them a few chops in the chopper. <laughs> Okay, we're waiting on the pecans. And you can put as many as you want on here. How much do you, how many pecans do you usually do? A cup? Uh, maybe a little more than a cup. Okay. J just sort of uh, do them on top like this. Okay. Now 
I have to do a mold. And you can take this to um, anywhere, really. I mean, it's church a, gatherings. Yes, church, church. gatherings. Th this is. It really goes over good. Everybody likes mm -hmm. it. It's not. It's not real sweet, and uh, but but it's it's really good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Caleb loves them. I like it with a scoop of vanilla ice cream on top. Ooh. Okay, and you bake it on uh, 350 for about, uh, I'd say about an hour. Okay. So uh, we're gonna put it in the oven and we'll show a picture as soon as it gets done. Thanks for watching. All right, guys, we're taking our blueberry crunch out of the oven and it looks delicious. Look at there. Now we are going to have us some of this. Now, Grady, which green kid likes the blueberry crunch the most? Caleb, and I'm fixing to call him down, and I want him to eat all he wants. <laughs> well, all right. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we will tune in tomorrow. Tune in tomorrow. We are going to be making dinner for you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.